Hi folks, so I'm going to record a very short uh, demo describing and showing an example of packers. So a lot of malware authors obviously want to make their malware look different um, and one of the ways they do that is by packing the software. So they want to avoid detection um, or just alter themselves so that they don't match the same signature. So there are lots of different packers um, and many of them are used for completely legitimate purposes and I'll show you an example of uh, UPX which is the um, what is that the ultimate packer for executables and it's open source software um, so UPX can be used to pack a program so let's just so if we take the ls command and we create a packed version um, here, then um, basically it will take that and it will compress it, takes the executable, compresses it to make it smaller, um, and creates a new executable that, basically, that it does the exact same thing um, in a compressed uh, way. So now if we... Um, If we compare the output of, say, strings from the original, um, we can see that. Let's have a look. So there's a bunch of um, things here that we can pull directly out of the binary file. But if we do the same thing to the um, local version, um, you can see that there is a lot less, um, essentially. There is, in this case, that uh, they're not hiding the fact that it's been been packed, um, but you know we can't access any of those things without um, unpacking the executables. Those strings are no longer easily searchable. Uh, the behavior is a bit more difficult to figure out without managing to reverse the packing process. Um, but in this case, you know, with the compression as well. Um, if we look at the um, actual file, we can see that uh, so this packed version is 61 kilobytes compared to the original, which is 136 kilobytes. So it's quite a lot um, smaller the new version, um, but also if we execute the new version, um, it works, you know, just as well. So. Um, does exactly the same thing, um, but now it's um, it's packed. So a lot of malware, anti-malware software, will basically try and extract or unpack any executables before it tries analyzing them. But obviously, um, you know, malicious attackers will use packers and, um, and not just UPX, which is um, maybe the most popular for non-malicious purposes. Um, you know, just for distributing source. Um, distributing compiled programs that are smaller, um, but they will um, use ones that will specifically to make it difficult for your, you to do your analysis.